this is Billing from the Burning Kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to do a typically a Cantonese dish. It's called Wak San Ha Yan Ho Fan. Stir fry silky egg Ho Fan with king prawn. Okay, the unique uh, thing about this dish is that it is the silkiness of the egg, you know. So it's not easy, you know, to uh, to cook up to that standard, you know, because if you overcook the egg, it can hard. Okay, if it's undercooked, it becomes watery. So it must be just like uh, like what you call that, uh, maybe slightly less than a half oil egg, that kind of texture. Okay, so when you eat it, uh, it's really very smooth and very silky. Okay, I hope I can achieve that uh, today. <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> I use this potato flour in Cantonese it's called Fong Che Fan in Mandarin it's a Fong Che Fan okay, this is a quite a good brand it, it makes the gravy very smooth it doesn't really uh, you know, turn watery so quickly okay, so now I'm deshell and devein the prawn Okay, now I go to skip a slip at the back to remove the vein. After washing the prawn, I got the pet dry with an efficient power. I crack the egg now because I needed some of the egg uh, to marinate the prawn. Okay, to marinate the prawn, I add in some sugar, some salt, and then some egg. Just give it a stir. Now I'm going to clean wrap the prawn and leave it in the fridge for about 20 minutes so that uh, when I fry it, it will become very crunchy. Now I have to remove the root and the top part of the bean sprout. I like to do that because I find it's uh, neater and it's more crunchy. I peel the chai sim leaf by leaf, arrange it nicely. Cut off the bottom part. Okay, now I've got to remove the skin from the ginger by scraping it with a knife like this and then slice it thinly Now I cut the chilli with thin slices like this So I put salt and oyster sauce and then next I add in some sesame oil and then water and then give it a stir Okay, next to thicken the gravy, I use a potato flour Water and mix it well. So I add in one tablespoon of oil in the wok, the wok high heat. Add in the hao fan and I cook for a minute or so. I use a chopstick to turn it around like this. Then I add in the uh, light soy sauce. And also I add in the bread vinegar, toss it a few times until it's aromatic. Then I transfer onto the plate. Add in the oil and then add in the chai sim. And add in the bean sprout and then I stir fry. You now add in one tablespoon of oil over high heat. Then add in the sliced ginger and stir fry until aromatic. Then add in the prawn and then stir fry for one minute until it's about 70 to 80 percent cooked. Okay, now I add in the bowl of uh, gravy ingredient and cook until it's boiling. Then add in all the chai shim and the bean sprout and stir well. And then add back the prawn in. Then next I add in the starch mixture to thicken the gravy. Then I add in the beaten egg and spread it around the gravy mixture until the egg is just about cooked. And then turn off the fire. 
Last I put in the Shaoxing Jiu and then throw the whole gravy over the Hao Fan and ready to be served. A few moments later. Happy Mother's Day. <laughs> Yeah, 我跟你讲 <laughs> if you like our cooking video, please subscribe to our Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. YouTube. Okay? Okay. Yeah. So, <laughs> 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 <laughs>